Yo, what a fam, the tactical Chesley is here! Welcome back to more Vampire. So, to be honest, I wouldn't expect that this game has so much to offer as you have lots of things to do, starting with side missions, having conversations, getting hints on NPCs to know how to properly deal with each one, combat system, loot system, baby upgrades and of course story missions the game is getting so exciting as you go further so i do really hope you are coming here and watch my videos to have a pure great time with me so what i'm gonna do is to continue doing story missions of course we are now at the sewer skulls territory i want to give you a quick recap we saved that dude sean hampton from william bishop but unfortunately he turned into a scout Skelly you can say is kind of vampire species so Sean Hampton killed a patient in Pembroke hospital and escaped but we had a conversation with him and he seems to be innocent you know but we will find that very soon but before that let me talk to that lady over here to get some hints for our journey and I hope you enjoy fam Yo lady, oh we can talk to her. Are you kidding me? Oh shit, okay. I thought that we could, but anyway. We gotta talk and check on Harriet Jones. Someone is crying like a mofo. That dude, yeah. Uh, let me talk to him. Eternal gratitude for your protection, master. Eternal gratitude for your what? protection, master. That's it. We can truly talk to him. Our uh, skulls. Okay. Old Bridget says you are one to trust. Hmm. Keep your distance, Echo. Uh, that one is a fucking bitch. Yo! <gasps> Ascalon has stalked us for ages upon ages. Hmm. Okay. Let me talk to Harriet Jones. That's Harriet, right? Let me loot first. That's uh, a habit that I do, you know. Loot before. Talk. Hello, Harriet. Do you recognize me? Hmm, yes. You were from the Pembroke Hospital. The young doctor. So full of secrets. Oh, I've that's... I've questions I need to ask you, Harriet. If you would. I love questions. As for the answers, you may not like them. Dude, that's the lady who... Loves to gossip, you know. I think. Interesting. How do you feel you fake your death? Yeah! She's supposed to be dead. I don't know. She turned into a scowl. Your room. The blood. What brought you to fake your death in such a gruesome fashion? To see if I would be mourned. Hmm. Why flee with Sean Hampton? Oh, it's always a pleasure to see a saint fall to sin. But the coward still won't kill. See? We suspect that he's innocent. Not a criminal, you know. Do you take pleasure in causing so much pain and sorrow? Nobody gave a damn about me. Not a tear shed. Poor Harriet. Always the discarded. Oh, get over it. How do you feel? I can't see. I can't move. Oh, my, my body's burning. I feel as if I'm dying over and over again. I mean, who turned you into a skull? I think Sean Hampton, yeah. Can you eat a drink? Is it painful? 
Have you tried to eat or drink something? People here tried to feed me, but I'm just not hungry. I don't have the strength. You know, skulls are, you know, deformed vampire. Does the pain ever stop? It is not pain I feel. It's like I, I can't stop feeling every inch of my body. But at the same time, each muscle and bone is the wrong place. Why did you come here? And why not? This is where I live now. Oh, you'd leave me be. Oh, whatever. You pay old Bridget. Dear, do you desire to stay here? So you desire to stay here? Yes, I'm with my own kind. Birds of a feather, so to speak. Poor Harriet, always alone. Hmm. Will you respect old Bridget's wishes? Will you obey her? Bridget is kind. She only needs to keep me fed and I'll be good. I'll be damned. I have a question of the utmost importance to ask. Will you answer? Questions, questions, questions. The good doctor always searching for answers. Do you remember what you did after leaving the hospital? Did you kill anyone? First, a question from me. You answer first. Very well then. What do you want to know? Are you like me? Are you also dead? We are similar, but not the same, Harriet. I like what I am. I truly do. I relish the pain that courses through me. I know you fled the hospital with Sean Hampton. Did you or Sean kill anyone in your flight? Anyone? Try and remember. I will not lie. I wanted blood and I wanted revenge and Sean pulled me from it. Brought me here instead. But the shadows heard my prayers. The shadows killed that bastard. Who was that man? The one murdered in the street? He used to be my landlord. I lived here for many years before falling ill. Oh, he was an awful man. Disgusting and cruel. So cruel. He got killed. You sought vengeance by your own hand and someone else obliged you. Very convenient. Mm -hmm. Don't lie to me. I don't lie. I saw him near the docks, and rightly I wished him dead. And I am happy he is. It's true. But I didn't kill him. I was too tired. Shadows? Tell me what you saw. The shadows. They heard me and answered. Something in the deep darkness. Quick. Deadly. It asked me if I wanted revenge. I answered, yes. Okay. Shadows, this presence, do you still hear it? Was it a vampire? Did Sean see it? It spoke only to me. And now it is silent. But it is born of hatred. <laughs> and it will kill again. And it hates you, Doctor. Oh, it hates you. What makes you say that? It... it whispered your name, Dr. Reed. It wanted to know who you were and where you went. Questions about me? What did you say? Nothing, Doctor. I said nothing. There was nothing it didn't already know. Liar! Oh, I'm tired now. Let me rest. Okay, so that shadow might kill that poor dude in the hospital. Supremacy of icons. Okay. So go back to Sean Hampton's shelter and confront him. 
Yeah. So the thing is right. Oh. Okay. Have you found the answers you were looking for, young Ekon? There is too much left unanswered. So many questions. Get to know us. Spend time with us, and I may be willing to answer more questions. I wanted to talk to you, lady. Here we go. Your diction, your words. You do not carry yourself like most skulls I've encountered. True. I'm not like most skulls. You were once someone else. What happened to you? It is as sad as it is long, young Ekon, but it will remain mine. Hmm. Can I be of service to you? We ask but one thing. Reveal to no one our secrets. Do not betray us. We made a bond here. <laughs> when have you been hiding here? For how long have you been in hiding here? Skulls have been hiding under London since vampires first entered the city. Where did you hide before the sewers? We claimed ancient tunnels, forgotten caverns, catacombs. We are skulls, groveling beneath the feet of our makers. Why do you live here, amongst the filth and vermin? Live. Here we hide. Okay, where do you live? <laughs> Where are you hiding from? Why not leave the city? What are you hiding from? From the guilt, the shame, from the hunters and the light. And of course, our past. Hmm, I would hide. Why don't you leave the city? Hide somewhere far from the guard of Prewan, the Ascalon Club. We are the Sewer Skulls. This is our domain. We have run as far as we can. And now we hide. Interesting. What manner of creature is Harriet? She is different from everyone else. I really don't know. I'm not even certain she is a skull. I've no idea as to what blood made her. What is a skull, in fact, in your honest opinion? The progeny of a vampire, disavowed by her maker. Hmm. Perhaps a fruitless branch of a noble tree. A word used to enslave us. I cannot say. You mentioned that vampire blood has tremendous potency. You believe it to be stronger than your own? Oh, the vampire's sweet blood. That rich, dark wine that we crave. For it made us, and it can sustain us. I thank you for your time, madam. I must go back to Sean Hampton now. Your kindness has been ample payment, Ekon. To protect us, I'll close the access to our hideout, but you can use our shortcut to reach Mr. Hampton's shelter. Oh. Just follow the arrows. Oh, lady. Thank you. Thank you, old Bridget. I hope we'll meet again. She's a deformed skull, but she's sexy in a way. <laughs> Or I'm just kinky. <laughs> uh, we can use a shortcut, she said. Where that shortcut anyway? Yo. Oh fuck off. I think that's the shortcut. Yeah. We're gonna go and confront him now. Oh, we can't open that? It's, it's locked. Uh, come on. So what shortcut, lady? Oh, that that's a new NPC. Investigation, yeah. Let me loot first. Yeah, you know me. You know me, dude. Are you all right, sir? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Don't you know this is a quarantine zone? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating the epidemic. You had better get to a safe place while you still can. Oh, really? Well, go investigate somewhere else and leave me be. I beg your pardon? I said go. Leave me alone, sir. What? 
find out the reason why that terrified young man is hiding in the sewers that's a side mission and I, I don't think that we can talk to him again so about the side mission oh the, the side mission is near the story mission so where are we going actually uh, okay I'm gonna take that way What I conclude, you know, that there is a shadow, you know, oh, that's the shortcut, yeah. There is a shadow that killed the dude in the hospital. You know, not Sean Hampton, not Harriet, not that sexy weird lady we just talked to, you know. So, accordingly, we are gonna face Sean Hampton. I'm gonna find the shortcut there is an arrow here we can go I didn't go from here okay okay that could be the shortcut yeah hell yeah uh, what did we just do? Oh, okay, we unlocked that door. Hell yeah! Okay. Alright. A new area discovered. So... You know, we kinda can do side mission and story mission in the same time. It's locked. Oh shit, man. Skeleton. God damn. Is there doctors here? I don't know. Okay, let me just see something. Okay, so. <laughs> we gotta do, you know, the. It's oh away. shit, yeah, yeah. Sorry, man. We gotta do the story mission first, actually, before we do the side mission. Sean Hampton. Welcome back, Dr. Reed. Would you like to take communion with me now? Let's face each other, shall we? Sean, are you eating raw flesh? It is the sacred flesh of the mortal lamb. Damn his kingdom. Our Lord's bountiful transmutation for the sustenance of his believers. Motherfucker, I'm gonna fuck you up. Thank you, Lord. I am your most humble servant. I don't feel good about him. So, true to your word, you waited for my return. I told you, Dr. Reed. I was a man to be trusted. Did you have words with the poor Harriet? Okay, so get ready for a vicious fight, actually. If you take mortars and skulls, you have some nerves. You hide your game well. This shelter is the tip of the iceberg. You hide your game well, I'll give you that. We are God's children, Dr. Reed. One and all. And he's determined to save us. Hmm. What will be the result if you continue to assist both Skulls and the living? For the last decade, that's what's been happening. And they found a better life. What's to change? You're forgetting the epidemic. Things can go south very quickly. I've seen it. Oh, these are terrible times. Only those pure of heart shall prevail. You've turned Skull now. Don't you see the danger to anyone giving you their trust? We are all sinners, awaiting salvation. This is a simple truth, ordained by the Lord Almighty. I am a seeker of his glorious light. Does this place belong to you? How can you be so certain you can keep it open? This warehouse was once property of the Dawson family, but has been bequeathed me through donation. 
Hmm. The Dawsons? The wealthiest family in London? Have they a clue as to what goes on here? Of course not. Not at all. The donation was made before the war. The building was run down. I never met Aloysius Dawson myself. So you have the run of the place and no one's taken notice? As long as we keep to ourselves, we interest no one. This is a haven, and I pray it remains so for eons to come. Harriet, Miss Jones has been behaving in a most violent manner. She's going to need special attention. That's precisely the reason I brought her here. To meet old Bridget. She's the guide Harriet requires. Old Bridget, I think that's the kinky sexy <laughs> scal we just talked to. Who is this old Bridget? I don't know, Doctor. She rarely speaks of her past, but I know she has a long one. She's likely the oldest soul in the city. Harriet is possessed by her hatred. You cannot let her roam free. She's dangerous. She has joined her own client, Doctor. Old Bridget is a saint to the younger Skulls, guiding them to salvation and peaceful existence. I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm certain you've killed no one, but one day I believe you'll cross the line. <sighs> Logic is a false prophet. Faith is the only path to salvation. What do you mean? We have been blessed with God's eternity. We are the instruments of his divine will. We shall feed the hungry forever and ever. Amen. I haven't the luxury of being able to satisfy my hunger on staunch blood and lifeless flesh. Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your urges and kneel before the Lord in praise. These urges. You know the hunger will never be satisfied. I've come to embrace the everlasting craving. I have sworn to feed only upon the flesh of the dead. It is now my sacrament. Take. Eat. This is my body. So saith the Lord. I don't like you, man. Ah, I can actually embrace him and kill him. You know, I envy the peace you have found, spare. Ah, shit. <laughs> God damn. I don't know what to do, man. Ah. But you know, if I killed him, the skulls, all the skulls will go against me, man. And to be honest, you know, you gotta fucking win them to continue in the story. And still, I'm gonna fucking manipulate Sean Hampton until the best moment. I believe you, Sean. In fact, I envy the peace you found, and will remember it. There is love and compassion in your heart. You only need to give it wings. Thank you for your kind words, Sean. Continue your noble efforts. You are a good man in bad times. Keep to the light, my friend. Like all my flock, you have a home here. Any time you're in the neighborhood. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Okay, new citizens available to kill. <laughs> Hint failed. Hint lost. Ah, was abandoned in Catholic orphanage when he was a baby. God damn, mesmerizing level 6 and I'm level 3. Ah, 
you can just kill a pillar. Let me tell you. Can I talk to him again? Nope. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna wait for the perfect moment, dude. But anyway, I think that would be it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you soon, baby. Peace.